Hey folks, this is Jesse with Keeping It Real Finance, the channel that always has your back and tells it like it is. Today's video is going to be all about Solana. So this is a platform I wasn't even aware of until a few weeks ago when it started popping up in the comments. I figured there would be no better time than now to do a video on it, which includes a thorough review and price prediction for 2021. So, I'm going to be getting all into Solana today. You're not going to want to miss this one as they have a lot going on, a lot of strong partnerships, and a very bright future. So, as always, if you're a first time viewer, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Click the bell to turn on notifications so that you're made aware when I post content just like this. And if you enjoy today's video, make sure to hit the like button. And now, let's get it going. So what is Solana? Solana is a fast, secure, censorship-resistant blockchain providing the open infrastructure for global adoption. Now, their main selling feature of their blockchain is scalability and low fees. So per Solana, serious builders choose Solana for millions of users. Solana's blazing speed and low fees scale as the ecosystem grows without sacrificing censorship resistance or security. Now, Solana claims that they can reach 50,000 transactions per second. So that's a lot. Now, a little bit of background. So Solana Labs was co-founded by Anatoly Yakovenko, a former software engineer and senior manager from Qualcomm, along with Greg Fitzgerald, also of Qualcomm, in October 2017. Now, work began on Solana in 2017 with the mainnet launching in March of 2020. So the Solana Foundation is headquartered in Geneva, Switzerland. Now, Eight core innovations enable the scalability of billions of users around the world, and they are Proof of History, Tower BFT, Turbine, Gulfstream, Sea Level, Pipeline, Cloud Break, and Archivers. Now, market ranking. Let's talk about this. So currently Solana ranks number 18 in market cap with nearly 4.4 billion and 24 hour trading volume at half a billion dollars. Now, Solana is capped with a max amount of coins at nearly 489 million coins. However, the current circulating supply is only 262 million coins. Now, the current price is floating around $17.38 as of this recording. Now, if you look at the chart, volume has really started to pick up in February, which has propelled the price upward. Now, what I really like are all of the different partnerships that Solana already has. So they have them in AMM, App, DeFi, DEX, Exchange, Explorer, Infrastructure, Oracle, SPL, Stablecoin Tools, and Wallet. <laughs> so if you go to their website, they've got like a hundred of these there, right? Now, Solana is already partnered with some of the biggest names in crypto, including Chainlink, they're partnered with Terra. This is the Luna coin. I've already done a video on them. Uh, Tether, there's Band Protocol, The Graph. Those are just some of the projects, right? Um, in the DeFi space in particular, Serum and Oxygen both stand out to me. Serum, by the way, is available on Voyager for anybody who wants to know. Um, Solana, on the other hand, is not yet available on Voyager, but Serum is, so remember that. Now for a price prediction. So Solana started the year at roughly $1.61, and as of this recording, it was trading at $17.38, or a nearly 11x in the first two months of the year. Now if they maintain the same rate of growth, Solana would 55x by the end of the year with a value of roughly $955. Now, if it only had half of the rate of growth, it would finish the year around 391 or a 22.5x. Now, I really don't see why it couldn't do that or better, okay? I actually think it's probably gonna hit 22.5x or better. I also think Solana will go higher with more exchange listings. So currently the best place that you can find Solana, in my view, 
would be Binance or Binance.us if you were in the USA. Uh, some of the other large exchanges, Voyager, Coinbase, Crypto.com, it's not there yet. Uh, but it could be in the future, right? So as it adds to the, as it gets in more exchanges, Solana could absolutely go higher and higher, folks. Now, what I absolutely love about it is this is one of those projects that, as I say in every video, it does it faster, cheaper, it's more efficient. It does all the things that Ethereum doesn't, is basically the gist. And that's why it's gonna do really well. And for all these other uh, protocols out there, why wouldn't they also work with a project like Solana? It just makes too much sense not to, especially when they can do 50,000 transactions per second. Now, per Vitalik, uh, Ethereum 2.0, he thinks could do 100, thousand transactions per second, but Ethereum 2.0 is two to three years out. So in the meantime, we have Solana here with 50,000 transactions per second, which is nothing to sneeze at, all right? <laughs> so the bottom line here, I'm calling for a 22.5X or better on Solana by the end of the year. I think this one is, is potential, it's got big potential. Uh, if you go to the website at solana.com, uh, they have a lot going on there. It's really quite impressive. Uh, so it's easy to use. Um, I, I, I like what they're doing here. It, it makes sense to me. The whole project makes a lot of sense. And that's why it's gotten a lot of attention. And so this is one of those ones that many people probably haven't even heard of as, because it's not on all the exchanges. But this, this is definitely an up and comer that could be given Ethereum a run for their money. So when we talk about all of the competitive uh, chains that will be out there, Cardano, Polkadot, the Binance Smart Chain, uh, this is a yet another one of them, Solana, all right? So that's today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I tried to keep it short and sweet. Uh, all about Solana with a review and price prediction for from now until the end of 2021. Now, as always, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget that I'm also on Twitter at KAR Finance is my Twitter handle. And uh, with that, this will probably be my last video for this week as my wife and I are leaving tomorrow for our 10 year wedding anniversary. So I will not be posting any more videos, but I will see you first thing next week uh, with a fresh set of videos, All right? So this is Jesse with Keeping It Real Finance, the channel that always has your back and tells it like it is. And I will see you on the next one later.